Sorry, uh, sorry I recorded, I forgot, I, get, I stopped. So, welcome all back, back for the uh, next part of uh, Sam and Max, A. Lincoln Must Die. Uh, sorry, sometimes I've been completely lost. That I forget I have to record it before making Wiz say what he has to say. Sorry, uh, you missed it. <laughs> so you really kicked the soda habit, huh? And how? Back when I was on the pop, I was in a real downward spiral. That endless cycle of always looking for my next fizz. Then having to take time out for number one. Then I saw that documentary about Peanut Franklin. And it convinced me I didn't want to be just another self-destructive former child star. Peanut Franklin, the lovable star of Mixed Nuts who was found in a seedy Hollywood motel room dead of anaphylactic shock? What you mean you ain't got no jelly? Still too soon, Max. Are you sure you wouldn't like a nice cold soda? Gee, thanks. I'll take a... Whoa, no! Stay strong, Wizard. You control the bubbles. The bubbles don't control you. Stop talking about soda, will ya? Stop talking about the crisp, clean taste or the effervescent fizz as it pours over ice into a frosty glass. All of it. I've been completely flat for over a month now. I can't go back to the way I used to be. I just can't. Tell us about the MRSAPP again. I have to get federal funding for the Soda Abuse Prevention Program. Go flat. Just say no to carbonation. Oh no, I said it before. See you later. Liberty Bell Land. The Liberty Bell is a light for this room. Just as America is a light for yes. Metaphor is such an ugly quality of furniture. Let's talk to the President. Mr. President of the United States. Hello, Mr. President. Wake up, Mr. We're ready to interpret. We're ready to interpret for you. Alright, let's get this party started. My fellow Americans, I come to warn you about a serious epidemic facing our country. The scourge of soda abuse. Many former popheads like myself found ourselves in the endless cycle of addiction and elimination until we believed there was no hope. I don't know what you're saying, son, but you're selling it, boy. Good job. I ask you, how long can this epidemic continue? What was that? He said. How long can this epidemic continue? How long can this epidemic continue? Epidemic? What's this about an epidemic? The epidemic of soda abuse, sir. By 2010, four out of five children will be addicted to soda. And the impact on our nation's plumbing system will be disastrous. What was that? Right. The epidemic of surely lessens teens. Mm. Something about soda abuse, blah, 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 whatever. Something about soda abuse, blah, blah, whatever. Hmm. Sounds like one of them touchy feely tax and spend welfare programs. He said, hmm, sounds like one of those... I heard what he said. Are you guys sure you're translating correctly? Don't blame us, buddy. You're the one with a speech impediment. Try it again from the top, wizard. <laughs> Once again, Mr. President, the impact Did you just of hear, soda hear, abuse hear, on hear our it? nation's health if you uh, if you did that's my stomach I didn't actually look how long can this epidemic continue great job great job what do you think he said god damn it mr president don't you know how to speak english how long can this epidemic continue there you go about an epidemic again what epidemic denying the problem won't make it go away mr president what was that denying the problem Epidemic of surly, listless teens. That is a problem. I blame the video games. What does that have to do with anything? I think he's confused. Let's start again from the top. Where was? How long can this epidemic continue? Sorry, okay. I had to say. Said, well, uh, where were you? Blah, blah 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 blah. Whatever. How long can this epidemic? There you go. About we say that. We say that. Baseball. Baseball fever. It's sweeping the nation. 
You said it, son. The crack of the bat, the roar of the crowd. But you know my favorite part? The frosty cold soda. Are you mocking me, Mr. President? Try it again from the top, wizard. Where? What? How? Yeah, uh, they said it. He said. Okay. Prepare to die. Prepare to die, capitalist oppressor. Are you trying to pick a fight with me, son? No, I'm just trying to educate you on a very important issue. What did he say? Don't you realize that I still love you? We will pay lay waste to your cities. We will lay waste to your cities and dance upon the bones of your children. I think I've heard just about enough. Soda abuse is a difficult topic, sir. But if you'll just hear me out, beg for your life and I will kill you last. Wait a second! I heard that! That's not what I said at all! What was that? It uh, loses something in the translation. Let's start over from where was. We I had it, we had it, we had it, we had it. Your age of terror ends your today. Your of terror ends today, those are fat and words, boy. But soda abuse is a very serious problem! What was that? Would you lay waste? Well, don't you realize that I've always... Don't you realize that I've always loved you? Oh, well, I'm flattered, son, but I'm afraid it wouldn't work out between us. What are you talking about? Is he taking it well? Buck up, wizard. There'll be other presidents. I don't understand. They're confused, wizard. Where? How? Oh, he's... About to die, Captain. So, so. Are you? No. What did he... <laughs> Men, launch the dragoons. Our victory is at hand. Hold on there, son. We can still find a peaceful solution to this. That's all we want. The Mount Rushmore Soda Abuse Prevention Program will bring peace to the lives of soda addicts everywhere. Aim destructo beam at 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. Fire on my mark. Three, two... Wait! I heard that! That's not what I said at all! I must have missed... Where what? Come on, he said. <laughs> what a what a guy gotta do to get a drink out here? What's a guy gotta do to get a drink around here? Aha! Uh -huh, I know what you need. And ice cold orange sugar fizz. I swear by it. No! That's not what I want at all! I must resist. But I am thirsty. And just one couldn't hurt. Frosty gold and so delicious. All the frosty. Jesus I've Christ, made, she's screaming it out now. Feel bad about this. I don't have a conscience, Sam. What's your excuse? No, no. Angel, oh, come me. to me, beautiful oh, angel. Fill me with your syrupy. Oh. Yeah. yeah, now I'm not so much guilty. I love all. angel sounds. Where's the, where's the bathroom? I think I messed up. Sam forgot to decline the noun for the past blue perfect subjunctive. I don't know what that means. It's okay, neither does he. Where was I? Oh, how long? Come again, he said. I need another drink. I soda. Need another soda. No problem. I've got plenty of soda. Yes, more. <laughs> he loves soda. Where's the bathroom? Where's the bathroom? Oh, that's easy. Go out the door behind you. Take a right. It's the door with the big portrait of LBJ over. Wait, say the line. Say the line. Time out for number one. Oh, I like when he says that. It's kind of cute. I'm sure he won't be long. He's an excitable little guy, ain't he? Where was I? Oh, right. Soda abuse. How long can this effort... We said it, we said it, we said it. I need another soda. Need another soda. No problem. I've got plenty. Yes. Blah, 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 blah. Skip it, skip it, skip it. Sorry, I don't get patience a lot. Oh, yeah. Except when it's about That's videos and stuff. I've from other people. Which way is... Which way is Lincoln's bedroom? Which way is Lincoln's bedroom? Oh, you do not want to go there, son. Place smells like a mausoleum. 
But if you really want to see it, it's down the hall to your right. He peed to it. Sam, did you just make an innocent person defile one of the most famous rooms in U.S. history? Apparently, I did. Where Jesus oh, Christ, did he I really pee on Lincoln's bedroom? They should Go make again. a video about it. Blabbity blue, 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 I think I translated that wrong. He asked, where's the reflecting pool? Out the front door, right in front of the Washington Monument. Can't miss it. Mm. Okay, you one more stuff. He said, I need another soda. No. One more soda left. Jesus God, you Christ, oh. I growl like a beast. The war room. Which way is the war room? Just that door right over there. But I know. Oh, thank you. Where do you think you're going? I've got to get in there. Dad! We've got a priority red number two here in the Oval Office. No, it's just number one. Escorting the suspect to holding cell for interrogation? Come with me, sir. But it'll only take a second. Please, let me go! That was fun. Okay, now I didn't catch all that. What did he say? Hello, Mr. President. You've been hypnotized, Mr. President. For the good of America, you have to snap out of it. Poppycock, I'm still as sharp as a vegetarian piranha's tooth. He's madder than a mongo with saddle rash and a yak blood allergy. Diplomacy's not working, Sam. I'll get the brass knuckles. We'll be back, sir. Now, let's knock him out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it's time for some checks and balances, freelance police style. Max, will you do the honors? Gladly. Look it, fellas. My fingertips look like little tadpoles. Boom. They just don't make these guys like they used to. That's no guy, Max. It's a damned ugly puppet. Ah, the drawstring in his back should have been our first clue. Our first clue should have been the swirly eyes. What, silly me? I thought hypnotizee, not hypnotizer. What? Yes, an ingenious device being used to hypnotize the TV-watching public. But who was controlling him? Gonna take days to get that smell out of the interrogation room. What? What have you done? He was like that when we got here. Sam did it! <laughs> so these two numbskulls managed to off the president. It was a deep tissue massage gone horribly wrong. Ninjas. Still... Ratings from the last State of the Union address were even lower than reruns of Midtown Cowboys. I didn't expect to have to replace the president so soon. But now that these idiots have forced my hand, uh, we're standing right here. We can hear everything you're saying. It's time for a leader that people will have to listen to. Agents Jackson, Burr, and Gambe, we are moving the timeline forward. Commence phase two of the operation. I'll prepare the new candidate. Abe Lincoln.